How do everybody? Welcome back to the channel for a Friday. Hope you're all doing all right. If you haven't done so already, hit the old subscribe button underneath and the notifications bell so you know every time I upload something. Thanks for everyone that's come along already. Over 8,000 subscribers now and climbing, so it's all good. Thank you very much. Well, what interests me in this video is how we perceive people that have been accused of a crime, be it nicking a loaf of bread from the shop or something a bit more serious like assault or some kind of sexual thing it really does uh, fascinate me how people are seen I mean you recognize this guy don't you yes he's the l little uh, dark chap that played uh, one of the companions in Doctor Who around the time of David Tennant, I think, and uh, Rose Tyler, Billy Piper. Well, he's uh, actually become a fairly successful actor and director in his own way, but he's in a bit of uh, hot water at the moment because he's been accused of uh, certain shenanigans, shall we say, and according to the press, it's by at least 20 different women they've accused him of impropriety, which, of course, he's denied to the uh, back teeth and he will do and he's got every right to make a denial or an admission whichever way he decides to play it but the fact of the matter is look at the results he he's been suspended by BAFTA he's been taken off air by Sky who say they won't work with him I probably think it's going to end up there again and again there's going to be a snowball of different people disassociating themselves with him because of a very damaging accusation. I mean, you look what's happening with Alex Belfield at the moment, for example. Five arrests, three house raids, no charge, no evidence, no nothing. Yet accusations have been made against him for numerous things, and he's been arrested for it without success. Jim Davison's another one, Cliff Richard. Look at the reputations that are damaged because of accusations that are unproven, and they end up all over the press. We have forgotten a very, very basic thing in this country, innocent until proven guilty. If he's accused of something, it doesn't mean he's guilty. Hell, he could be if the evidence pro proves he is, and then he should face the full force of the law. But at the moment, he's been accused. It needs investigating, and his innocence needs presuming until you know, such a time we know otherwise. You know, I'm I'm not getting involved in this either way or telling you what I think. I'm just telling you how I believe due process should work. And we seem to have lost our way and really been influenced by what we read, you know. He may never work again or he may have a damaged reputation. But the process needs to work itself out be interested to see what happens next anyway thanks guys i'll see you on the next one and as i said don't forget to subscribe give the video a like because we're climbing high and uh, i'll see you then ta-da